Hey everyone and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, I'll be doing a full guide on how you can successfully copy a space within ClickUp to a different workspace. So without further ado, let's dive right in. So one thing to note here is that spaces within ClickUp should not be cons confused with workspaces. If you guys want like a, an accurate description of what spaces actually are, they're kind of like subfolders within a workspace. So now that that's out of the way, let's actually get to copying it. So there's actually only really one way to copy a space on ClickUp, and that is to create a template of it. So let's pretend that I want to make a copy of dummy space over to a different workspace. So how do you actually do it? So you want to highlight the space that you want to copy, and you want to cl click on the three dots or the ellipses next to it. Next, you want to click on templates, and here you'll be greeted with three options, which I'll get back to later, but for now you want to save this as a template. So once you're on this page here, you want to give it a name. So let's just call this one dummy space copy. And here you'll have the freedom to uh, choose its privacy settings, like uh, who can access it, which coworkers can actually see the, the new space and whatnot. But for you, the most important thing here is to make sure that public sharing is enabled. So we're going to click on that. And here, like I said, you get to choose who, who can see the workspace. But for now, let's leave it on default. So once you've done all of that, you want to click on Save as Template. And depending on how big the space actually is, and by that I mean how many projects are involved or how many people are within that space or you know documents and whatnot, it may take, it may take a while for ClickUp to generate a copy of it. But once it does, you should be greeted with this message right here saying your space template has been created. So once you're, once you're done with that, you wanna click on the three dots again, like I said before, and click on templates and click on browse templates. Now, once you're on this page, you want to make sure that this is highlighted space right here. And here you can see the template that we just made. So the next step is to simply click on this and to click on share. And once you click on share, you can see that there's a copy link. I mean, there's a URL here that we're going to copy. So once you've copied that link, you want to close this and you want to transfer to the workspace on which you want to transfer the space to. So let's say I want to transfer the space that we just created to this workspace here. So you want to simply click on this and you want to paste the URL onto your browser and click enter. And when you do, you'll see here that ClickUp will bring up a window where you'll get configured the new space. And as you can see, I wanted to put the, uh, I want to put the new space in this workspace and um, let's just leave the name as is and click on use template. And here, after waiting for a while, you'll see that ClickUp has successfully copied over that space to this new workspace. So everything within that project, or that space rather, should be here, like projects, uh, documents, notes, and whatnot. But yeah, that's how you do it. That's how you copy a space within ClickUp to a different workspace. So thank you all for watching. If you guys found this guide helpful, be sure to show your support to the channel by subscribing. We do. We actually do videos like these daily, so uh, if, you, if you don't want to miss out on those, be sure to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and make sure that the bell notification is turned on. So thank you all for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.